So I did five property viewings every week for one year. Here's what happened. So in this video, we discuss the truly magical things that happen when you view a property every single week for a year. Watch this video all the way through to the very end to find out what opportunities arose. And I'm going to leave you with an absolute killer tip to boost your property game. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Marco. I'm a portfolio landlord, property investor, developer, and mentor. And I love helping people invest in residential property. So let's dive straight into it. Now, the first thing that happens when you view a property every single week for a year is that you put a lot of miles on your car. However, the second and the most important thing is that so many opportunities are presented to you. You yourself are creating these opportunities and that's what this video is all about. We're going to talk about the opportunities and the look that comes your way when you view property weekly. So let's flip this round. Let's say you only view a couple of properties a year. Well, we can't really expect much from that, you know, especially we're not going to get a great deal from just viewing a few properties every single year, right? But let's flip this round. Let's say we're just going on two property viewings a week, not five. Let's just say we're going to, on two. And roughly speaking, that's rough, you know, 100 viewings over the course of that year. Now, Truly amazing things start to happen when you view 100 properties every single year. And let's face it, two viewings per week isn't a huge call on your time. So if you're going on 100 viewings per year, it really doesn't take much luck to profit hugely in property. Now, what I like to talk about is a ratio, a ratio of viewings to offers accepted. Now, in the, when the market's really fierce and really competitive, you could be going on 15 to 20 viewings to get a single great deal. But when the market's screaming and poor and confidence is rock bottom, you can go on three or four viewings and get a really good deal. Now, as I record this video, I'm recording it in 2024, beginning of quarter three. It's a more confident market it's you know investors are coming back to the market but it's certainly not as buoyant as it was say in 2021 at the moment I'm having to go on say 15 viewings to get one really good deal accepted however let's let's multiply that let's say we're only going on two viewings per week that's 100 viewings a year that's easily six incredible deals every single year that you can create for yourself now here's the thing one of those could be an absolutely life-changing deal and if you go on five viewings a week you can come across several life-changing deals every single year so if I I can give you any advice before we go into this video and before we talk about the opportunities and I'll give you some other benefits is put the reps in go on viewings you won't be disappointed so before we come on to two real examples of my portfolio that came about from going on such viewings there are loads of benefits to going on viewings of course we're one step closer to getting a great property deal across the line but really first of all we're building and enhancing our relationships with agents which is so vitally important I mean just today I had an agent messing me message me saying I've got a property for sale I'm not going to market if you can give me the price we're looking for, then we can mark it as sold and take it off the books. There was a little bit of negotiation from that price, but we got a sale agreed. She didn't have to put it on the open market and I wrapped up a really good deal without anyone else even viewing that property. So this is why actually viewing and putting the reps in in the first instance is really important because it helps build that relationship with agents. And once you've completed on that very first deal with that particular agent, they know you're serious. They're going to start calling you before they put the property on Rightmove, before they put the property on Zoopla. So that's one really good benefit of going on viewings. Build building and bettering your relationship with agents. The second benefit of going on viewings more regularly is that you're going to have a better feel for market values. If you're viewing two properties a week in a particular area, you're going to know what's good price, what's a poor price. You're going to have a better gut feel. You're going to be closer to the market. Now, what does this mean? This means you can have greater confidence in your figures and therefore you can be putting forward offers in a timely manner. Who knows, perhaps you could offer same day or perhaps whilst you're at the viewing if you are really confident with your figures. So let's go over two examples of what happened to me in my portfolio when I went on so many viewings. And then we're going to end with the killer tip. So first of all, we're going to go back to an opportunity that was on the open market. I found it on Rightmove. Um, it was several houses in LS27 in Leeds, um, listed for a very reasonable price. I viewed the property, fell in love with it straight away. The price, the asking price was reasonable as well. Uh, of course, I didn't offer asking. I went slightly below asking, but we agreed at a figure that worked for us both. Now, I still to this day can't understand why someone else didn't beat me to it. I genuinely have no idea. It's been one of the best investments for me. It's generated me at least £200,000 in profit from doing no work at all. It's a very hands-off passive investment and it's an absolutely wonders for me. Now, here is the benefit of going on switch viewings. Now and again, you're going to come across a property where for some reason there's little competition. Who knows, the stars just align that particular day and there's no one viewing the property. Maybe there's only three people viewing the property and those two aren't going to be putting forward any offers and that comes down to you. And whatever you offer, providing the seller is willing to sell, that's what the property's worth, right? So if you're putting in the reps and you're viewing properties, now and again, you're gonna come across a property where 
In fact, it's a great deal, but for whatever reason, people aren't going through the door to view it. And all it takes is a little bit of luck on your part, you to be the only single buyer presenting an offer and therefore providing the seller is willing to sell, you more or less have that deal secured. And don't be fooled into thinking that you need to do work or need to do a refurb to make this happen. You know, the, the property that I've already mentioned required no work whatsoever. In fact, it was refurbed a couple of years before I even bought it. There was already tenants in place. So it was a complete hands-off investment for me. I rarely go there now because they take over so nicely and the standard of the property and the refurb is so high. So the maintenance on that particular property is less than average. Are you new to property or perhaps you have a couple of properties but you're looking to scale your portfolio, then this video is made with you in mind. It's that time of year again and I'm looking to work with a handful of individuals that are looking to up and boost their property game. Individuals that are looking to work with me to help hold them accountable, to give them a second opinion and to be there in their corner to help them grow a property portfolio. My goal is for you to be completely self-sufficient within 12 months of working together. Self-sufficient in the sense that you can assess and appraise and purchase property deals by yourself. Not only that, but you have the confidence to invest in property on your own terms. Now is your chance to book your initial consultation with me. The link is in the description. Now this is a normally a paid for service. However, for the next few weeks, it's completely free of charge. So please do take me up on this. If you've been watching these videos and been following me for a while and been thinking about reaching out, now is your chance to reach out completely free of charge at no loss to you. Now don't take my word for it, read all the reviews about my coaching service. Now in the past years we've had mentees obtain a 35% discount to market values and we've had mentees profit £100,000 within those 12 months of working together. The results speak for themselves. What's more I offer a 100% satisfaction guarantee and money back promise. So before we conclude, I have a few questions for you. Are you new to property or you have some experience? Are you looking to generate an income through property? Or in fact, are you looking to invest in property with confidence? If the answer to all those three questions are yes, then I strongly urge you to book that call with me. As I've already mentioned, the link is in the description. I look forward to seeing you on that very call. Goodbye. So the second example I've got for you, which is where I viewed a property, I agreed a price with the agent and that property completed. It was just a bog standard terrace property, nothing special, very boring, very vanilla, but it's proved very profitable to date. So fast forward with a complete on this deal, I called the agent again and I said, well, I'm looking to buy a few more in the area. Let me know if anything comes up. So she replied, well, come round to my office, pick up the keys, do the viewings today, come back and let me know what you can go on them. So I did that. I went to her office, I picked up the keys, did the viewings in my own time with no other competition, it's not even a right move, it's not on Zoopla, uh, and went back to the office and we agreed a price on three other properties. And that's because I went on viewings initially to get the first purchase, but after the first purchase, she trusted me and she was able to get me into properties that she just gave me the key, she, you know, she, she trusts me implicitly because we've already completed on one deal. The properties weren't listed on the open market and I could pretty much dictate a price. And providing my price, you know, didn't take the mickey too much, it was accepted. So we got those three across the line. Now the funny thing is, fast forward to this year, 2024, I've actually got another two properties from that particular agent. Again, all off market, these deals weren't on Rightmove or Zoopla. I was privy to them first, she gave me a call, she said, right, I've got a client, he's moving to Dubai. He's got five properties and he needs to part with them. And we managed to agree a price on two of those five properties. Now it's really important because I would have never come across any of those subsequent deals if I hadn't initially viewed that property face to face with her. So put in the reps, get those viewing booked in, and I know it's going to reward you in the medium to long term. Now it's the tip that I give to a lot of my mentees, which is, I I, well, I encourage everyone to have a weekly planner. So it's just a page of A4. You can do it on a computer if you like, but I prefer to do it pen and paper. A page of A4. And at the end of the week, there's a few things that we need to tick off. And if we talk about this video in terms of viewing property, one thing, question that I ask myself is, have I viewed at least two properties this week? And I like to tick that off, yes. And providing I'm viewing two properties a week, I know truly magical things are going to happen for me in that particular year. It doesn't take much to get a life-changing deal across the line at two properties per week. So that's my tip for you today. Implement that question into your checklist. And I know it's going to give you a hell of a lot of success. So to summarize, truly amazing things happen when you view property when you say go on two or five viewings per week. It really doesn't take much to have a, get a life-changing deal across the line and you're creating these opportunities for yourself. Absolutely incredible and it's going to make you very very satisfied when you, when you create these types of opportunities for yourself. So what to do next? If you're looking to scale and to grow a property portfolio, consider working with me. I can
can help coach you to achieve your aims. The link is in the description. And if you have a question or a comment or anything else, please do pop it below in the video. As you know, I respond to all very nice and positive comments in the video below. Now, I'm going to let YouTube decide what video to present to you next. I really hope you've got value from this video and I wish to see you on that very next video. Take care. Goodbye.